Hello and thank you for watching this video. Today I will show you how you can import products in bulk from Amazon to WooCommerce. To do this, you will need to install a Chrome extension. So I will go to Chrome extensions. I'll search for WooShark Amazon and we'll install this Chrome extension called Dropship and Affiliate for Amazon and WooCommerce. I will add this to Chrome. It will take some minutes and then it, you will see this pop-up here. So don't worry, we will try to fill together this pop-up in order to connect to your store. Sometimes by mistake, this pop-up is closed. So in order to open again the pop-up, you can go here and click extension you search the extension that has been installed is this one go to details and then options so and you will have again the same pop-up i will explain a bit what you will have here so on the first field you will paste your wordpress url so this is our shop i will copy all the parts before the wp dash admin I will copy it and I will paste it here. So you will see that it will start with HTTP or with HTTPS. Then you will need the, the client key and the secret key. These are very easy to generate. You can go to WooCommerce, setting, then add advanced, then REST API. You can create a new one you can create as many as you want so test and then you set read write permission here and then you generate you copy the first one on the first field you copy the second secret key on the second field and this is the activation key it's not mandatory but if you want to use all the advanced feature of the extension you will need an activation key that you can get from our website http Ushark. Amazon and then you can buy license from here give it some seconds until it is displayed here okay once you pasted the third field you can test your connection it will take some time so okay connected successfully I will go back to read the message connected successfully activation code not valid free version is enabled okay that's that's very good so now I can go to Amazon, I can go to with all Amazon domains, Most, mostly actually all Amazon domains, I will try to go to, um, I don't know, for example, uh, UK, for example, Amazon domain, just, I choose the random Amazon domain, and then I will search for some products like, uh, uh, ah, Xiaomi, okay. You will see a little pop-up here, new feature bulk import in testing phase. For any issue, please email us. Okay, this is, we have just released this feature, so you can face some uh, bugs. So if you have any bugs, please contact us. Here, you click the button, enable bulk import. And then you will see that you have some new button that appears here. You can choose which product you want to add. For example, I will add this one. Note that the product that will be added here will be added as affiliate product or as simple product like we will not import variable product if you want to import variable product you will need to use the single import you can enter here and then use the single import but for the bulk import it will work for affiliate marketing or for simple products so here you see that there is one product on the waiting list i will add another product here you will see that take some seconds and then it's here again let's say I want to add also this one and then I want to go to the second page and add some other products I click enable bulk again and then I add this one here in total I will have four products I click on this button here Images, description, and reviews will be not be imported using the free version. Okay, the free version does not allow to import all the details. You will get most 
of the information data but if you want all the information you need to to get the license so here you go to products to see if the products have been imported successfully and you see that we have this three show me, show me product that are here so I will open them one like I will take one random one to see if everything is fine okay I see there is one image the free version allowed to import one image the title the price the short description additional information the SKU the category and I'll show you actually what you can import for the reviews and description it's not important because it's only available on the premium version and also the other images so now I can customize how the product will be imported to do this I will go to the extension configuration so to do to find the extension configuration you, you do the same thing you did you did the, uh, before like it's this page here you see that there is here the price formula you can automate the price uh, by creating one formula so for all products falling between zero and one million I will increase the price by 100% and I will add two dollar two units here to the price then I will save I did not finish yet so I will go back here and then this is the configuration for single import we have another video for single import and this is for bulk import so for bulk import I will check what I can do so I will reload this page okay here I want to import the product product as affiliate product so if I disable this option the product will not be imported as affiliate but but as a simple product the difference is that for affiliate product the user will be redirected to Amazon the end user the your customer will be redirected to Amazon but if you select simple product the user will purchase the product on your shop which is called drop shipping here you can paste your um, affiliate ID for example Toto 2020 for example just your affiliate ID in order to concatenate it to the final URL here is the button that you want to to see the, the the user will see when he will uh, purchase the button if you are using affiliate otherwise this button will not be displayed so I will use right now please <laughs> just for testing purpose here I will add some tags so for example stylish uh, good I don't know some some tags that will be associated to the product and will help to improve the SEO here there are some parameters so if you want to import high resolution images you can select this one the loading time will take more time here so if you select it it will be uh, faster import import short description import description import reviews import specification if enable the product will be published so if you want to publish the product if you want the product to be featured product and then the categories and then I will save and I will try to import again some other product I will load this one and I will search for smart smartphones again is the same process I will enable the thing here and I will add some to product let's say <coughs> okay so three products in total and then I will import them the same pop-up will be displayed because we are, we are using the free version if you want to enable the premium version what you need to do is to purchase the license and you paste it here and connect again that's all mm -hmm. so the product have been inserted successfully you will go to check one product so as you can see here there are the tags imported the categories the price it's in stock the SKU the title so everything is imported actually oh, sorry I think is this the product that we just imported okay yeah it's called also Xiaomi so yeah it's trash I will push take this one I thought it's the old product but it's the new one so here I open the product I see also already buy no please so it's the button so if you click this one I'll be redirected to Amazon product and I will see my tag here 
So if the user buy this product, you'll get your affiliate margin. I'll go, go back to the product here. So it's the same thing. So here I have more categories and tags, the additional information, the reviews are not imported. In one next video, I will show you how this works if I use the premium version. So I will see more images here, like around 10 images. I will see the description, like all the description from the product and the reviews here, like the 10 first reviews. If you want to import single products, you can just go here and use the extension. Here, the difference is that you can import product as affiliate product with more customization options as uh, affiliate product or as dropshipping product. So here you can see that you want, you can modify directly the title, uh, the URL, the button, the description, so this is the dropship pro product. It's taking more time because it's collecting the variations. Here it's finished loading, okay. So here the description, you can import, enhance the description by adding uh, some other options from here. The gallery, you can import images from variation, from reviews. Here are the reviews, the variations with images variation the specification and the product tags. That's all for this video. See you on next video and thank you very much.